Hey there fellow readers, Mrs. Weidman here, and today we're going to be talking about the young adult realistic fiction book, The 909 Project by Mark H. Parsons. And this book is about a boy, and his name is Jameson Deaver. There he is on the cover, right? And if you can't tell from the front cover artwork, Jameson Deaver is actually an amateur photographer, right? He loves taking pictures. And during the course of this book, he actually has a very special project going on. And every night at 9.09, .09, right, he goes to the same exact street corner. And he just photographs the different scenes that he finds there. Of course, he asks people if they can be his subjects, right? And then he takes pictures of their interactions or whatever it is that they were doing at 9.09 .09 on this corner. And then he takes the best of those pictures and kind of just saves them in a file on his folder. And he's not quite sure what he wants to do with these pictures just yet. Well, the reason Jameson is actually out on the corner every night at 9.09 .09 is because that's a corner that he could see from his mother's hospital window. And unfortunately, a year before this book takes place, Jameson's mom passed away from cancer, right? And she actually died at exactly 9.09 .09 p.m. And so Jameson really connects with this time. There's something important and momentous, and he just can't quite get it out of his head. Well, as this project kind of evolves, right, Jameson actually discovers he wants to share his photos of the 909 project with the greater world. So he creates a website and the project just sorts of sort of takes off. And Jameson is very surprised by this. It was very unexpected. However, kind of the most surprising thing is that Jameson really finds a new way to connect with not only other kids at his high school, but he finds a really meaningful way to reconnect with his sister and also his father, who are really stuck in this, these throes of grief over the loss of their mother as well. Um, this is a great next read right, for anybody who loves realistic fiction, who likes books about overcoming grief, who likes books about navigating this crazy world that we call high school, right, and the social hierarchies that we find there, especially when it comes to new relationships and new friendships and figuring out who it is that really cares about you and those that maybe don't. This is one of those books that I really, really, really liked. I can't quite say that I loved it. It's just there's something about it that doesn't push it there, but it is still an incredible read. So one I highly recommend, and I hope to see you all online soon. Have a good day.